for this week's theme, I'm here to talk to you about how a B-movie can actually change itself into one of the most greatest films ever made. And one great example is actually released by Warner Brothers in 1942, and it's Michael T Curtis's greatest film, Casablanca. Few movies are as famous as Casablanca, the 1942 film set during World War II. However, Casablanca began production not as a film, but as a play. Murray Burnett and Joan Allison's unproduced play, Everybody Come to Rick's, was sold to producer Hal Wallace for the sum of $20,000, the most ever paid for an unproduced play. Wallace took the concept to Warner Brothers. The project was renamed to Casablanca after the film's gambling den and production began in May of 1942. Film it went over budget at over a million dollars and began filming without the script completed. Wallace's first choice for director was William Wyler, but he was unavailable during that time, so Wallace turned to his friend Michael Curtiz. Today, Casablanca is commonly cited as one of the greatest films of all time, and is frequently parodied and referenced by other media, including the 1995 Warner Brothers cartoon, Carrot Blanca.